all my face right now instead of yours. They put opal here, and I highly apologize. I didn't upload a video in a while, like I promised. Um, had a bit of issue with the Wi-Fi. Um, the article it was on Limited Network was on day, and apparently I used it up to this month. So, excuse me. Oops. There we go. <laughs> so, I thought I'd do another blog video, and not just a blog, but a questions and answers video since I haven't done one, and a lot of you seem to really want to get to know me. So, um, I'm actually wearing my EJ cosplay. What, did you really think my EJ actually made all this? Oh no. I made the mask. I have the hoodie. It was mine. I just let him borrow it to help me with the video. God damn it. Um, <laughs> I have some questions written down on this paper, which is actually on the back of it. It's from the Chinese blind side. And, well, let's get to it. The sound strips they asked me, would you ever hurt an animal even for money? No, I'm sorry. Even if you paid me so much money, I just couldn't bring myself to do it. It's not fair on the animals, they don't deserve it. And frankly, with what's been going on in the news, like with the gorilla shooting and all, and the lion shooting, I just, I just don't think it's the animal's fault, I think it's more us. So no, I wouldn't hurt an animal if you paid me. I wouldn't be working an animal job anyway if I did. <laughs> and Moonlight Crescent asked me, what is your favourite food? Hmm, tough one. I, I wouldn't have a proper favourite since I like so many different foods. I like pasta, I like pizza, strawberries, chocolate, sweets. Anything like that, but I guess if I had to pick a favourite, it would be sushi. Don't judge me. <laughs> um, Moonlight Christmas does ask favourite movie. Oof, tough one. Um, I guess I'll have to say it would be Trick or Treat by Michael Douglas. I probably said this last name wrong. If I have, I apologise. But just the way he's actually stuck to the proper Halloween theme and the traditions of Halloween and if you break certain rules this little demon punk in head called Sam puts you in your place and makes sure you don't break the Halloween season rules and it was fantastic. I know there's other films that I like but I think that's my personal favourite. And she's also asked where do you live? Um, I'm actually from the UK. Why Great Britain? Not <clears throat> recently. I used to live around Kent, Medway in England. I actually moved a few weeks ago, near enough a month ago now, as some of you may know. And now I live in the Isle of Wight, UK. Right, so. Yay! <laughs> no, I don't know anymore. Excuse my slight sad voice. Um, this is my real voice. I just deepened my voice a lot for the other videos because I was a bit worried and sceptical, but I thought use my actual real voice for a change. It's a bit muffled because of the mask and I apologise. Um, from my Tumblr, because obviously I've asked people from Tumblr, Facebook and Google Plus to ask me questions. Um, Anomalous asks, what fandoms are you into? Well, I like um, Creepypasta, obviously, because my mascot's the Creepypasta. Um, uh, I don't really mind the My Little Pony fandom. I don't watch it anymore. I kind of stopped after season three because I just couldn't keep up with it. Um, quite a few, I can't think of some names at the top of my head, but quite a few. Five Nights at Freddy's, okay. 
I like it more for the characters and the games than anything else, really. Um, yeah. Also, uh, if I play this one, I apologise now. Peekaboo! Pikachu? A very specific. She's asked me, are you a furry now? Yes, I am a furry. Don't panic, I'm not one of those sexual type ones because that's stereotypical behaviour and we're misjudged for it. But yes, I am a furry. And I'm also a Peggy sister, a creepy pasta. Not a fan girl, obviously, because I've gone too far. But yeah, just to name a few. Next one's from Peekaboo. Cute. Um, he's asked me, How old are you? I think I actually answered this once before. I am 21 now. So, yeah. I turned 21 this year. I did answer this once before, I even had a live stream for my 21st. So, go check that out if you haven't. Um, ghostly ghost, ghosty ghosty ghost, what a name, has asked, uh, what did he ask? Oh, he asked, um, What's your sexuality? Being in room. No, not the question, I'm biased outside. Um, I'm actually a pansexual, but I'm also a demisexual. Now, pansexual means you just don't care about someone's gender, you, you still like them for who they are, you just go more for the personality. Demisexual means you have to have a close emotional bond with the one you love before you do anything sexual. So, yeah. Uh, a few more then. Um, this one's from Hoodie Chan. Hey Hoodie. He's asked me, are you single? Wink in face. Hmm. Yes, I am single. I've been single since January. Um, I don't think I'll be getting anyone anytime soon because I just don't feel a connection with anyone else and it'd be quite awkward if I did like someone. So, no. I don't think... I'm single but don't get any ideas yet. <laughs> I have to get to know you before anything. <laughs> the Masky Kim another person from Google Plus, has asked, I noticed you've been a little bit off today and I'm really concerned. What's going on with you? Um, this is kind of personal and I really don't want to go into too much detail because it's rude and it's not fair on the others. So I have to keep it hush-hush, but I'll, it's just a personal blip up with an old friend after a bit of a discussion to try and sort another mess out it's turned into a bigger mess I'm hoping it will get sorted out though if it doesn't what can you do? if you want to know more just private message me and I'll tell you though I don't want you to go and message the other people because it's not fair on them no, not fair on them whatsoever uh, two more then. Uh, this one's from the Lyveon Glaceon Twin Duo. And they've asked, said to me and asked, really love your videos, Rika Opal. Your character's awesome. Can't wait for our story to come back out. We love your videos. You always put a smile on our faces. And we just love you to pieces. Our question for you is, would we get any other videos apart from MND? Well, thank you so much for the compliment. That means such... 
here we go, it means so much to me and I'm so glad some of you guys like my videos and me personally and my character, I don't get much compliments about her. But don't worry, when my Wi-Fi comes back on, I'm hoping to do more gameplays with the squad, if it still happens, or with other people. Maybe some more discussion videos, maybe some more questions and answers, just anything random really. If you have a specific video you want me to try and do on my phone, like a question and answer or a different blog or discuss my opinion on stuff, then let me know in the comments below. But, uh, thank you very much, that means a lot. Last question then. What last question? <laughs> Last question is from, um, oh my god, I can say this name right, forgive me for this, Zina Nadnika Bich Bichon? Sorry, I, I, I can't speak, I, I can't pronounce it very well, I apologise. She basically said, you're an amazing YouTuber, Reaper Opal. Your videos are just all mixed and you don't stick to one thing, you spread yourself wide to others. You've helped me smile through the bad days and I just wanted to personally thank you for everything you do, even the hard work you put into them. Even if you think they're not good enough, I love them dearly. And your character is so amazing, you shouldn't let haters put you down for her. Just because she's unique and different and very decent for the creepypasta community. I think it's what the creepypasta fandom needed was a boost. So thank you ever so much for everything. And my question is for you, will we ever get to see you at conventions, if we live near you or anything like that? Also, will you reveal your face? I'm, I'm lost at words for that, I mean, I'm so touched, <laughs> thank you so much, um, about the question, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm actually, happy tears, happy tears, I promise, <laughs> <coughs> I'm alright, <laughs> um, about the conventions question, I've never been to a convention, I would love to, and even if, if I ever did, I would let everybody know, so you can come and find me, chat with me, whatever you want to do. If that ever happens, I don't know because of where I live, obviously. Closest I'll probably be able to do is London, but if that's the case, I'll let you guys know. Um, about my face review, it's not the first time you guys have seen my face. So I don't see why we don't can't end the video with a bit of a face review. If you can actually see my face. So, <laughs> you can't see me very well. Um, <laughs> it's not working, you can't see my face very well. <laughs> and I look scared because I'm wearing black. <laughs> anyway, um, thank you so much for the questions. Please keep them coming in. You know, I'm really grateful for them. And some of your compliments touched me, and I'm so grateful. I did need them, and I think that just put the icing on the cake for me. So thank you for that. Keep the questions coming in in the comments below. Give this video a like, subscribe, and comment your thoughts. And just keep looking out for the next video whenever I get around to doing them. So, um... Goodbye, my sweet nightmare sugar cubes.